Hello everybody, my name is Taylor Hollingsworth and I'm a recruiter at Snead State Community College. I want to start off by saying that I understand that this semester has not gone as planned at all. Um, we hope by making these Q&A videos that we can help you be more successful during your time here at Snead State. We also understand that these circumstances are very strange right now and things are constantly changing. And when it comes to changes at the college, we want to keep you as informed as possible during this whole situation. So for updated information regarding the college and COVID-19, please visit sneed.edu and the homepage has a direct link to all of those updates. And now I have my iPad here and I have all of the questions that you've submitted from social media and I'm going to start answering those for you. Our first question says, is Sneed State closed? So our campus and buildings are not open to the public right now. However, our college is fully functioning. Um, it just looks a little bit different right now. Our faculty and staff, we're all working from home, um, off campus remote locations and classes are remaining in session online. We are all working to serve our students and help you all adjust during this strange time. The next question says, are we continuing classes online for the remainder of the semester? Yes, the Alabama Community College System announced Friday that courses will continue for the remainder of the spring semester online. If you have any questions about your specific courses, you should contact your instructor um, directly through Blackboard. Okay, we've gotten a lot of questions about graduation, so we kind of lumped two questions together. Um, will there be a graduation ceremony and can I still get my cap and gown? So yes, there will be a commencement ceremony. However, it has been postponed from the original date in May. Details are still being worked out. Um, and as soon as we have those new details of when it is postponed to, we will send them out to you as soon as we get those. Hopefully it'll be in the next few weeks. Um, and cap and gowns will not be available until closer to time to the ceremony. So once we announce the ceremony dates, we'll also announce when you can pick up your cap and gown as well. I also want to add to that that even though commencement is not staying on schedule, diplomas will remain on schedule. So they will be mailed to the address listed on your application for degree. Um, those will be mailed approximately six to eight weeks after you have completed all of your degree requirements. So at the end of the semester that you complete your requirements, six to eight weeks after that, your diploma will be mailed to you. Do you have any idea when students should expect to hear if they've been awarded a scholarship to Sneed State? So if you're awarded a scholarship to Sneed State for fall 2020, um, you're still going to hear from us in late April. So you'll be mailed a letter to the mailing address that you put on your scholarship application. Um, also, if you're a high school senior, um, myself and the other recruiter will reach out to your counselor and let the counselors know um, which students have been awarded scholarships. When will summer registration open? April 1st. And this video should go live April 1st. So hopefully by the time you're listening to me, um, registration is up and running already. Is it too late to apply to take summer classes at Snead State? It is not too late. Um, the last day to add a full term or a mini one class for the summer is actually May 29th. And then we also have a mini two term in the summer um, that starts July 8th. So you can actually apply up until those dates, depending on which term that you're wanting to start. When can I apply for dual enrollment for the next school year? So dual enrollment students can apply any time. Um, you just have to meet the requirements for dual enrollment for Snead State. So your requirements are um, you must be entering the 10th, 11th, or 12th grade. Um, you have to have a cumulative unweighted high school GPA of 2.5 on a 4.0 scale. You also have to have a written approval from your principal and counselor um, to know about how to go about that um, and to learn more about the paperwork and things like that that you need for dual enrollment. We have a dual enrollment handbook on our website, sneed.edu. You can also email student services and um, we will get you that paperwork and answer any questions you have about dual enrollment. Our email address is studentservices at sneed.edu. Okay, does Sneed State offer a payment plan? Yes, we do offer a payment plan. Um, you can access that payment plan through your one ACCS account. Your one ACCS account um, is on the sneed.edu website. There is a menu at the top of the page. You can click one ACCS and you can log in there with your A number and your PIN. So that's where you access your payment plan. That's where you set up your payment plan. 
Um, if you have any specific questions about the payment plan, like how much are payments, how often do I have to pay, when is the deadline, things like that, um, those questions can be referred to the business office and the business office will answer your questions um, through email at businessoffice at sne.edu. Okay, this person says, I have admissions documents that I need to turn in. How should I get those submitted? So right now, the quickest way to get your admissions documents processed is by emailing them to admissions at sne.edu. You can do this by scanning documents and emailing them in. Um, if you don't have a scanner, you can just take a picture of them with your phone and email them in that way. Um, if you have a document that is official that cannot be sent electronically, you can still mail documents to the college. Um, but while we are working remotely, the mail is not getting checked as often. So we do ask that you give us five to seven days to process those documents that are being mailed in. Okay. The student says, I need to send my official transcript to another college. Can I still do that? Yes, you can still request an official transcript. That is also um, done through your one ACCS account like we talked about earlier. And if you need further help with this, if you need step-by-step -step instructions, feel free to email admissions. Their email address is admissions at sne.edu and they will answer all your questions about requesting an official transcript. Okay, if you have absolutely any more questions or concerns that were not talked about in this video, please feel free to email student services at sne.edu. We will answer absolutely any questions you can as soon as possible. You can also still send questions through all of our social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and we'll answer those questions in next week's Q&A video. Um, I also want to add, we are going to get through this odd time. Um, I'm really proud to work for a college that has put our students' safety and success first. Um, I could not be more proud to work for Sneed State during this time. Um, and from the entire Parson family, thank you for listening and stay safe.